guys, so today I'm going to be showing you a Japanese hair secret recipe. Basically, this is a DIY and this claims that it actually can give your hair that keratin treatment effect but done in a natural way and it also can smoothen the hair and get rid of the frizz. Alright, so let's get started. So the first ingredient is rice. I really suggest using organic rice because you don't want pesticides on your hair. And also you'll need four tablespoons of it. And also you'll need two cups of water. Now since I'm using a small mug, I had to double my proportion here. And from there, I will add in the four tablespoons of rice and then I will cook it and bring it up into a boil. Now I'm gonna make sure that the rice is cooked well just like this. It should look somehow watery like this and you actually would like it in this consistency. Cook the rice but not really all the way all the way where it's dry and then let it cool down and then after that I'm gonna put it in a blender and then puree it. Now you also have to make sure once again that it's really fine like this and then after that I'm going to sift it just to ensure that there are no rice grains in there. Now I'm going to set that aside and in here I will be using one tablespoon of cornstarch and dissolve it in water and then in a pan I will put back in the rice cream or the rice porridge in there and then gradually add the cornstarch mixture and then bring it up into a boil again. Now you have to aggressively stir it. You have to keep on stirring it just so that you don't burn the bottom of the pan or for it to curdle. You don't want that, trust me. Now when it gets into this consistency, go ahead and remove it from the fire and then let it cool down again. So this is how thick it should be. It needs to be pasty but not jelly-like. And then after that, I will be adding oils. I'm using avocado oil and almond oil in there, but you can also use any oil of your choice. I just use what I have available here. Now the instruction was to section the hair and apply it to fine sections but I did not do that because rebellion <laughs> and I'm also watching a series on Netflix so I was fully invested in that that I totally forgot to do that process but I did try to coat my whole hair just like that and I realized that it is very important to get the right consistency because if you don't it's going to curdle on your hair and it won't really lather smoothly like this now that i fully coated my hair with a rice cream i am going to use a plastic wrap you can also use a shower cap but the whole point here is to stretch the hair so i did it this way instead of putting my hair up in a bun now i left that on my hair for an hour and then i washed it off using my shampoo and this is the result i like how it gave my hair that keratin effect treatment or the hair Botox effect. It did actually relax my hair and my hair felt very soft and smooth too. Though I might warn you though that if your hair is protein sensitive or if you're experiencing protein overload, you might want to be very cautious when doing this because it may make your hair stiff. You, I mean, you can still do it, just don't overdo it. And also I can say though that doing the coconut hot oil treatment will actually give you the exact same results as this one just in case if you guys don't have any rice. But overall, I do like this treatment. Let me know if you guys have tried out this DIY too and what are your results. So that is it. If you all like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. And once again, share this video if you found this content valuable and I will see you on my next one. Bye.